Let's talk about how we can multiply two mixed numbers together. In order to multiply mixed numbers, we need to convert them to an improper fraction. So to convert two and one thirds, first, take note of the denominator. It's gonna stay the same. To get the numerator, it's gonna be two times three, which is six plus one. So that's seven. For the next one, the denominator is five, so that's gonna stay the same. To get the numerator, it's gonna be four times five, which is 20 plus two, so that's 22. Now, what we need to do is multiply across. Seven times 22. 22 is 20 plus two, and then we can multiply this by seven. Seven times 20, seven times two is 14, add the zero, that's 140. Two times seven is 14, so this is gonna be 154. On the bottom, we have three times five, which is 15. So as an improper fraction, the answer is 154 over 15. Now, let's convert this improper fraction to a mixed number. What is the highest multiple of 15 just under 154? It's gonna be 150. And 154 minus 150 is four. So we could break down 154 over 15 as 150 over 15 plus 4 over 15. Now 150 divided by 15 is 10. And 10 over 10 plus 4 over 15 is 10 and 4 fifteenths as a mixed number. So this is going to be our answer, which I'm going to rewrite it over here. So that's how you can multiply two mixed numbers together. First, you want to convert each mixed number into an improper fraction, multiply across, and then reconvert the improper fraction to a mixed number. Let's do the same for the second example. So let's convert these to improper fractions. First, let's keep the denominator the same. To get the numerator, it's going to be 3 times 4 plus 1. 3 times 4 is 12. 12 plus 1 is 13. For the next one, we have a denominator of six, so we'll keep that the same. Two times six is 12 plus five, that's gonna be 17. So now let's multiply across. So 13 times 17. We got three times one, which is 21. We'll write the one, carry over the two. Seven times one is seven plus two, that's nine. Write it zero. One times three is three. One times one is one. Add, we get 1, 3 plus 9 is 12, carry over the 1, 1 plus 1 is 2. So 13 times 17 is 221. 4 times 6 is 24. So the answer as an improper fraction is 221 over 24. Now what is the highest multiple of 24 just under 221? Well. Let's do some work. Let's write, let's write out the multiples of 24. We have 24, 48, 48 plus 24 is 72, 72 plus 24 is 96, 96 plus 24 is 120, 120 plus 24 is 144, add 24 to the, that, you get 168, 168 plus 24, 168 plus 20 is 188 plus 4, that's 192. 192 plus 24. 192 plus 20 is 212 plus 4, that's 216. If we add 24 to that, we'll be at 240. So the highest multiple of 24 just under 221 is 216. So 221, I can break that into 216 and what is the missing number? If we subtract 221 by 216, we'll get the missing number, which is 5. Now we know that 216 divided by 24 is going to be 9 because we have to add 24 9 times to get to 216. So now we have 9 plus 5 over 24, which is 9 and 5 24ths.
So this is going to be the answer as a mixed number. So that's how you can subtract, I mean, that's how you can multiply two mixed numbers together. It's by converting each mixed number into an improper fraction and then multiply those improper fractions by multiplying across and then convert the final answer back to a mixed number.